but the yes was, was a um, AI enabled shopping platform that allowed the customer to have a fully personalized store. So we used um, different signals, explicit signals to understand um, what brands she loved, what sizes she wore, what her overall style aesthetic was, so that each person who visited the Yes had an entirely different store that was based around her. So you and I would both go to the Yes, we'd open up the app or we'd go to the site. Our home feed would be completely personalized to things that we had expressed interest in, either by saying, I like this brand, or, I, or by yesing a product when we had been there before. That was the vision from the beginning. We started building it. We started, you know, the team, everything. When we, when we started, it was just me talking to brands. Um, our creative director would come with us, come with me sometimes, or Julie would come with me sometimes. And we, all we had in the beginning was, because we didn't, we hadn't built anything, but we had to show these brands something. So we had these prototypes that we made on our laptop. We were launching an app, but we had a prototype on a laptop. And I would walk around my laptop and we pers well, we personalized the prototype for every brand. So we would go in and be like, you know, we would go to Bottega and show them exactly what Bottega would look like in this experience that we were building. And actually, before we had a working version of the app, so just with that prototype, we had about 60 brands who signed up. And somewhere around, yeah, and somewhere when I, around when I got to like 35, I was like, oh boy, now what? I have all these brands who have signed up and I actually have nothing to do with them, which was when I hired the one and only and very incredible Blair Boyajian who worked for me. Um, and we joke around that she's like head of now what? Okay, like we need contracts signed and we need to keep them somewhere and we need, you know, we need an onboarding process and we need all of these things. And I was like, great. <laughs> so glad you're here. So yeah, so we had about 60 brands before we even had a working version of the app. And then we had a working version of the app, which was still sort of like clunky and weird. And we had to figure out like, how do you show somebody an app? Honestly, like building this thing was so fun. It was, we were really using brands feedback and customer feedback and our own feedback and building this sort of like ultimate shopping destination of what's the place that we always wanted to shop. And, and we were only in the early stages, like there was so much left to do and there's so much more that we will do, you know, now that we're a part of Pinterest. 